they just passed this uh, Pastors Protection Act in Texas. And it's, uh, it's so that pastors don't have to marry gay, lesbian, bisexual, transgender people. So it protects them from having that do that or be sued to do that. Um, the ironic thing is that before that, they never had to do that. And I only know that because I've been a pastor for 20 years. We don't have to marry anybody for any reason. So it's just propaganda. You know, so you see the type of thing of like these, these governments spending all this money, taking all this time, passing these bills that are literally just to build up some sort of frenzy or fear or because it's almost time to vote. So let's make people think that their, their, you know, their freedoms are in trouble or the Religious Freedom Acts. I mean, it sounds great, but all it is is an act to, to try to discriminate against LGBTQ people in their workplace, not in churches, because churches can discriminate all day long. I mean, we're separation of church and state. If you want to be discriminated against, just go to a church, and, and, and they can figure it out. They don't have to hire anybody. They can fire anybody, and uh, they don't, they're not covered under the Civil Rights Protection Act. So, you know, that's, that's the big difference there. And uh, so all these laws are kind of just distractions in something that I think is trying to get bases moved here and there, and it's kind of manipulative. And I find it, it bums me out because a lot of Christian leaders stand with it and they pretend. And because I'm familiar with the laws of what they're talking about, I know they're being disingenuous. So that to me is, is uh, it's so, it's so, it's so prevalent that it's almost not an oxymoron anymore. You know, I mean, it's so prevalent that it's just like, ugh. It's just, oh, it's just business as usual, which is kind of sad to me. And that's one of the reasons I want to do this, is kind of be able to talk about and say, you know, let's just, if we're going to do these things, let's just be honest with each other about it.